Hi, I'm Brandon, and welcome to the Tech Zone. In this week's tech tutorial episode, I'm going to show you how to take a screenshot with your iPhone. With the new iOS, there's like a cool new easy way to do this that should work with any iPhone, but I've got an iPhone 5S. The first step is you're going to need a picture to take a screenshot with. I've got this really cool picture that my girlfriend sent me yesterday. Isn't she cute? <laughs> So then, we're going to need to find a way to capture this image. So find a camera. I've got this disposable one. You hold it steady in this hand. And then you're going to take a picture of the picture. Once you're pretty sure you got the right shot, you're ready for the next step. Getting your film developed at the local photo mat. The photo mat usually takes about an hour to develop the film. Um, but then, then eventually you'll get um, your pictures back. You're going to want to find the one that you really liked. See, there it is. And then you're ready for the next step. In the next step, you're going to need to find yourself a digital camera. With that digital camera, you want to take a picture of that picture. And once you're confident you have the right shot, you're, you're ready for the next step. So you're going to find the play button on the back of the camera. Go through until you find the right picture. Uh, once you found a good one, you're ready for the next step. We're just going to need to find a photocopier. When you find the photocopier, put the LCD face down and then hit the start button. I could only find one that does black and white copies, but that's okay. You can use colored pencils, crayons, markers to, to color it in afterwards. I'm going to use this highlighter for my girlfriend's beautiful blonde hair. Once you've done all your touch up, you'll need to find a laptop and a digital scanner so that you can digitize the image. Um, so using the scanner's built-in software, you can magically transport the image into your computer. All right, so once you're done scanning and digitizing your image, you're ready for the next step, which is emailing the picture to yourself. Open your favorite browser, log into your email address, and then send that picture you scanned as an attachment. Once you click send, we can go back over to the phone and then download that attachment. All right, so once you've done that, the picture should be now your newest picture in your camera roll. So if we go over, yep, there it is, see? <laughs> and then, um, as an extra bonus optional step to back up your work, you can take a copy of that picture using the power button and the home button, you press it at the same time, and now you've got a backup picture, and you're done. That's how you take a screenshot on your iPhone. Thank you for watching, and tune in next week when I'll teach you how to record your favorite TV shows using Skype. Well, that's it. I've been Brandon. See you next time on The Zone.